In light of current events, many clinicians and therapists are transitioning their in-office services to remote therapy. After all, thought technologies start on neural feedback and de-stress systems make for great tools to lend to clients for guided at-home use. We've recently received quite a few inquiries about online services that enable remote therapy, such as programs that let you see a client's screen or allow you to control their computer. This short video is a review of popular choices currently available on the market. Skype is an automatic choice because it's free and clients tend to be more familiar with its use since they already use it for calling and keeping in contact with others. It includes mic and speakers audio and allows for a web camera to be used to verify sensor and electro placement. One of the negatives of Skype, however, is that there's no remote controlling of the computer, so you must teach the client to navigate the software themselves. Team Viewer is another popular choice that is mostly free and allows you to take remote control of an individual's computer. Recent added features allow you to integrate audio and web camera as well, and initiating a session is quick. One of the negatives of TeamViewer, however, is that the interface can be cumbersome at times. Zoom, GoToMeeting, Fast Support, and other more advanced softwares for telemedicine and remote access are surging in popularity, especially right now in this era of wanting to do more remote work. The pros of these systems are they have well-refined integrated audio, whether it's using mic and speakers or a call-in option. They also have web cameras to verify sensor and electro placement. There's definite possibilities for remote control of computer, as well as elaborate scheduling features where you can set up sessions days and weeks in advance that recur regularly with private links sent to separate clients. Most of these services are also currently offering demonstrations for you to get an idea of how their service works. The negative for these different services are that naturally they are paid and that the controls and scheduling can be complex if you're not good with software. Thought Technology is committed to helping you through these unusual times, so if you reach out to our technical support team, we'd be happy to assist you in setting up your remote training practice.